when people walk underneath it, sometimes it takes them a minute to realize that you know, there's something following them. We are here to take a look at the FlexNet interface, which is a digital art installation. This is for a fifth year architecture studio. Um, and the studio is process based. Um, what that means is, is rather than designing a product, like we typically design buildings uh, in these studios, um, we are focused more on the process of, of designing something. The interface is this network that uh, basically captures people moving under it in a heavy uh, food traffic area at the University of Arizona. One of the concepts for this uh, uh, design thesis project was to use economic uh, material and be able to construct it fast and make it deployable and transportable. This power strip's probably bad. I mean, this this one? Yeah, I mean, the ground's ripped off, so. The FlexNet was a challenge uh, uh, considering the, the, the coding uh, side of it, simply because as architects you're not trained to do computer programming. So which one are you going to run? Particle. Processing was uh, software that we used uh, for uh, getting the recording of the people and being able to transform that image into an artistic effect. We had webcams throughout the installation that uh, when people walk underneath the installation it tracks them, towards them, um, and then reinterprets them and to make more an, an interactive ins uh, uh, the digital art. So they, they are the ones creating this, this, this art form um, you know, through just using the, the given space. People interact with it in all sorts of ways. Um, we initially thought that people would just travel underneath it. Um, so what we try to do is, is make it more interactive. It, it tries to uh, go around the trees. It, it creates this gesture of receiving the people that come this way and then another gesture of people uh, either exiting this space or, or just getting ready to interact with it. At this point, being fifth years, you know, we're, we're usually pretty excited about our work, you know, because we get to, we have a lot of design freedom and we get to express ourselves through our work. There's a large um, array of iterations that, that took place um, throughout the semester for each of the details of the entire installation. We progressed over here with uh, the entire crowd of faculty and, and, uh, and uh, adjunct lecturers and everybody to, to come criticize us. Um, so we, f we finished the review here um, underneath the installation. And they got to see the uh, um, the ability that the installation has to, to track the given space and uh, use the multimedia and the projections and uh, of course the scripts that we wrote. People really like it. People have uh, have come close to it. I feel that they, they develop more of a connection to the installation, you know, in that sense, um, just because they are creating this this kind of art without you know we sort of effortlessly creating this this form of art, you know. So they start to you know do different gestures and dance and. and uh, or they'll wave at it or, or keep walking or run underneath it. We see people run underneath it. I'm very happy with it. Yeah, I think it's, uh, I think it's um, an interesting uh, addition to the student union, uh, whether it be temporary or not. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's a fun, uh, fun space that we created.